Hey there, Manny Cabrera from Sidekicks Family Martial Arts. I hope that your Monday and your week is off to an amazing start. Uh, you know, I wanted to talk today about how being a black belt um, means being responsible. Now, just as a quick aside, um, I wrote about my own experiences of, you know, the responsibility I felt um, about being a black belt on our blog. Um, you can go actually read that article at uh, www.sidekicks.me um, if that's something that you're interested in, in, in reading. Um, you know, my perspective on being a black belt or what my responsibilities as a black belt has changed over the years, um, especially, you know, as I've gotten older, um, but also as, you know, I went through the experience of becoming an instructor and eventually, you know, bringing up uh, the next generation of black belts. Um, you know, so it's been one of those, you know, journeys um, that, you know, I, I've gone through. Um, but, you know, as part of, you know, talking about responsibility this month here at Sidekicks as part of our Powerful Words Character Development Program, you know, I wanted to talk about um, you know, how being a black belt means being responsible. Um, now, many of us have, you know, had classmates or coworkers <coughs> who always, you know, make excuses um, and blame others for their, uh, their problems or their failings. Um, you know, often these people are usually in inconsistent, they're unreliable, they're undisciplined, or they lack, you know, mental toughness um, and determination. And worst of all, they're probably pretty irresponsible as well. Um, you know, being responsible for one's decisions and actions is one of the most important um, traits of being a black belt. As a, a martial arts student, you know, you must learn to be responsible for your own actions. And, you know, you should be a problem solver, not a, an excuse maker. Um, one of my favorite quotes comes from John Taffer, the host of uh, Bar Rescue on Spike Television. Um, it's, uh, you know, I don't embrace excuses, I embrace, embrace solutions. And that should really, as a black belt, that should be your mantra a, a, as well. Um, you know, if you, you know, want to, you know, if you want to act responsibility, then the first step really is to look at yourself, you know, you know, and, and, and look for improvement there. You know, don't expect others to solve your problems for you, you know, especially if, you know, you take a hard look and realize that you're the reason that the problems are there in the first place. Um, you know, you must learn to be a reliable person, you know, who will always support and help your classmates, you know, or your family, your friends, you know, your coworkers in, in, in at work if you're an adult. Um, you know, you, you need to learn to accept discipline as a benefit um, of being a true, you know, as a, a true black belt, you know, to maintain self-control um, during all situations. And, and that self-discipline and self-control is something that comes from within inside of us, ourselves. Um, it's not, you know, something that comes from the outside. Um, if you're a responsible student, um, then you'll be also mentally tough and you'll be enthusiastic and confident and uh, you'll have a positive attitude about it. Um, you know, responsibility is a major um, challenge that all martial arts students face, you know, during their daily training. Other challenges, uh, you know, include outside distractions, kind of like the noise that we have going on in here. But you probably should see what's going on inside. We have our after schoolers already kicking butt in there. Um, you, know, you know, outside distractions or, or physical limitations um, or even, you know, sometimes, you know, intellectual burnout. Sometimes we just get tired of doing something. Um, you know, react to those challenges with a positive attitude and you'll understand, you know, that being a black belt um, and being a responsible person are really the same thing. You know, it's really the same idea. Um, so, you know, ask yourself, you know, the following questions. Um, here's a couple quick questions that you can ask yourself um, to test your responsibility level or, you know, if you're a parent of a student in our program, um, you can also ask your children. Um, you know, and if you answer the question with, you know, an honest yes, then, you know, you have the spirit of a black belt. Um, if your, you know, answer is not yes, then really don't beat yourself up about it. You know, look for, to figure out how it is that you can improve and take it to the next level. So here's some questions um, that you can ask yourself. Do you conduct yourself responsibility? Um, you know, are you conducting yourself responsibility, responsibly, sorry, at home or in school? You know, in class here at Sidekicks, um, you know, everywhere and at every time. Uh, do you understand the responsibilities of leadership? If you're a leader, do you understand the responsibilities that go along with that? Um, you know, as a leader, are you a positive role model for responsible behavior? Are you demonstrating those things to others as well? Um, do you persevere through physical challenges even though you want, um, you know, you want to stop? You know, are you, are you persevering through even though you, when you want to stop? Do you remain calm and focused um, to prevent your mind from wandering? You know, sometimes we can get in a panic spiral or we can wind ourselves up. Um, you know, train your mind. You know, train your heart to make the best and most responsible decisions that you can. 
you know don't take make decision you know don't make bad decisions you know or irresponsible ones you know look to you know overcome the things that are real obstacles to your success um, you won't regret it you know and uh, remember that you know being a black belt means being responsible you know I hope that uh, this was helpful and if you have any questions you can always contact me directly um, you either PM me through Facebook at, at Manny Cabrera 3 or you can give me an email uh, my name is mcabrera3 at sidekicks.me have a powerful day